Hey, Gwen. Nice new house you have there. You need a lift? No thanks, Miles. I'm good. Leave me alone, Miles. Come on, Gwen. I thought you and me were cool. We're cool, but I don't want a lift. So thanks, but stop following me. Don't say anything, man. Just pretend like she's not even here. Ugh, I can't. Hey, I was hoping I could talk to you. No time to talk, I'm busy. It'll only take a minute. I said I'm busy. Ugh, she's changed, man. That's not the Gwen I knew. Or maybe that was always the Gwen I knew. I just didn't see it before. Good evening, Gwen. We missed you. Ah, good. You are taking to Gwen well. That is good. Indeed it is. Soon you will be just like us, and your mind will be free to control Gwen, and we'll be together forever. We can't wait. Come. There's much for us to do. The night is young, and the island is our playground. Of course. Let's have some fun. <laughs> fun. From a distance, that is. Agreed. We feel like breaking more stuff. Hey, loser! Give us all your tater tots! We don't sell those, and we're closed. The kitchen isn't serving anything. What? Ah! Can't you see that we're trying to impress Gwen? If you aren't going to serve us food, then we'll have to do it ourselves. <laughs> we should be a fry cook. Hey, empty the register. You heard us. Give us all the money. Now! Or we'll get our boyfriend to eat your face. Our life during the day isn't nearly as fun as this. When we leave the house, we're met by Miles Morales. He won't leave us alone. Thinks he can make us love him again. Ha! What a loser! And then when we get to work, our ex is there ready to pounce on us, begging us to get back with him. Who's that? Spider-Man. Peter Parker. Yuck! We hate Peter Parker! He is the biggest loser of them all! We have an idea. Why don't we go and get rid of them? You know what? Let's do it. This is Miles' place. Yeah, It's a dump. 
will be doing him a favor. <laughs> Watch this. <laughs> Miles won't bother us anymore. This was a good idea, Venom. Venom? <laughs> Run, Venom! <laughs> Breaking into that racetrack was a great idea. We think these are the cars for kids. We don't care. The night is still ours, and we can do as we like. Soon you will be fully taken by the symbiote. And then, we will be together for all time. We can't wait. Is this his house? We think so. Then we will enjoy this, thoroughly. <laughs> hey, what's going on in here? Ah, spider. Nice place you've got. What have you done to my kitchen? Oh! <laughs> nice. Sorry about the wall. It's gonna get cold in there. This should keep him warm. <laughs> that was so much fun. It was. Spending time with you. Growing our powers. <laughs> this is the life. It is. Wait, what time is it? Close to dawn. Uh-oh. Return to us. You will have your chance once again. Gah! What a weird dream. No miles today. Must have given up trying to drive us to work. Hmm. Peter? Are you here? We're just asking because we feel like you're gonna jump out at us or something. He's not here. Weird. He hasn't missed an opportunity to corner us at work. Guess they finally got the picture. We just want to be left alone. Wait, our speech. W what's going on? Why can't we not say, I? Why do we feel like we're more than one person? Ah! Gwen. What? Who said that? Your time has come. <laughs> what are we doing here, Venom? 
We have something super awesome to show you. What is it? Someone left this thing here, and it's freaking amazing. Well, what are you waiting for? Show me how it's done, Venom. Oh, we will. <laughs> what do you think? Pretty amazing, right? I want to try. Natural. Hello there. I saw you driving. That was pretty sick. Nice wheels, too. Oh, well, thank you. We are Venom. Gwen. I am Princess Shori of Wakanda. I've just arrived here, but I'm not quite sure where here is. You're on the island. Yes. It's where people and creatures from all different dimensions come to party. Do you mean dimensions? Have I traveled through the multiverse? Uh, we aren't the best ones to ask about that, but we can show you around. You two look a lot like someone from my Earth. You are like a different version of Spider-Man, yes? I am? Ah, wonderful. And there are other heroes from Earth. Perhaps you can bring me to them, if you would be so kind. We're a little busy here. Why don't you look for the blimp? They'll take care of you. Oh, I see. Well then, perhaps I shall find my own way then. Wait up. We can help you. Venom! Sorry about her. We can show you around the island. There are many wonderful places to see. Oh, very well then. Lead the way, Venom. <sighs> I don't like this. Oh, not this place is something else. Welcome to the Rave Cave, Shuri. We usually come out after dark, but that's the best time to be around. Parties go on all night long around this side of the island. You'll never be bored around us. I'm coming in. Come on, Gwen. Dance with us. Ugh, I'm fine here. Oh, come on, Gwen. You know you want to dance. The vibes here are amazing. I don't wanna. Sorry, Shuri. Gwen, what's the matter? I'd like to go home now. Oh, well, would you like us to bring you home? Yes, let's go now. Come on, Venom. But Shuri doesn't know anyone else around here. I don't care about Shori! Hmm. Alright, let's bring you home. Oh, they left me. Gwen, what's the matter? We thought you were in a good mood. Well, now I'm not. I thought we were out on a date tonight together, Venom. Yes? 
And then you decided to make a new friend and bring her along to flirt with and dance with all night. What? We weren't flirting. We were just being nice. Don't give me that, Venom. You totally forgot that we were supposed to be having time together, didn't you? No, we didn't. Uh, but we did forget that maybe you should not bring a third person on a date. Uh-huh. Little late for that now. Good night, Venom. Yaw, we messed up. First we leave Shuri alone with no one to show her around, and now we mess things up with Gwen. We feel depressed. Ugh. Maybe we can do something right tonight. I wonder... Perhaps Shuri is still at the rave cave. We can go and make sure she's still safe. Oh yeah, I always come here when I'm off duty. Wow. That's fascinating. So, Star Wars is a real thing in this place. Huh? I'm not sure what you mean. Never mind. Might have said too much. I don't want to break your mind. Oh, okay. Well, anyway, what about you? Do you have a boyfriend? Beat it, loser. <laughs> Where did you run off to? We had to bring Gwen home. Oh, no. I'm sorry to hear that. Well, I was shocked when you two left. Thought we were all getting along great. We thought so too. That's why we came back. So you didn't think we just bailed for no reason. Oh, that's a relief. I'm starting to think you guys didn't like me. Not at all. You're great. Now let's keep this party going. Somehow, Space Invaders seems wrong. What? Why? All you have to do is shoot the aliens. We are an alien. Oh, right. I didn't know you were sensitive about all that stuff. Wanna swap? Sure. What are you playing? Pac-Man, you gotta eat things and stay away from ghosts. Eat things? This is our kind of game. Hello. Huh? Oh, hi Shuri. We are playing Pac-Man. Nice. Very retro. Venom, what is she doing here? Oh, we invited her to hang out. Huh. Did you now? Hope that's okay. I still haven't made many other friends yet. Who said we're friends? Shuri, do the dance machine. Over here. I love this game. You're kidding me. He has no clue how much this bothers me. New high score! Oh yeah! Sure he's got moves. What the? What the? What do you think you're doing? Getting the high score. No, I mean, what are you doing hugging my boyfriend like that? Can't you see that we're a thing? I wasn't trying to get between you both. I promise. I thought we were friends. We are friends. Not anymore. I don't like you, Shori. What did I do? I already told you. Me and Venom are dating, and I don't want you here. So get lost. You have been nothing but rude to me from the moment we met. I do not deserve to be spoken to like this. What's the big bad Black Panther gonna do about it? Do not threaten the Black Panther. Stay away from my boyfriend. Gwen, we have never seen this side of you. I'm sorry, Venom. You're too nice to have seen it, but Shori was trying to get between us. I did what I had to do. No, Gwen. Don't be sorry. Seeing you behave like this, 
so passionately. You must truly feel for us. We have never been more attracted to you. Really? Indeed. We don't care about Shuri. No one gets between Venom and Gwen. And now I'm gonna beat her high score. The last thing I remember is driving with Venom, and then Carnage. <laughs> That's right. You belong to us now. And as soon as we've dealt with that pest Venom, your symbiote will be mine. And what about me? What's going to happen when you take the symbiote away? Well, once our symbiote and yours merge, we are going to need something to eat. Aren't we? <laughs> I have to find a way to get out of here. So, as soon as he wakes up, we find out what happened to Gwen. I'm not waiting around for answers. Huh? Hey, where's Gwen? Huh? What did you do with her? Leave me alone, man. Hey! Ah, we lost him! You really need to get better at this part of the job. Come on, we have to find him. Let us back in. We need the body. I've been trapped in here for who knows how long. Uh, it's so good to breathe fresh air again. Forget about it. We are taking control. Ah, that's better. Now, where is Carnage? Carnage must have taken her. Hmm. We've got a scent. We're coming for you, Gwen. won't get away from me this time. Gwen? Gwen, are you here? Yeah. Carnage. Where is Gwen? You are so close, Venom, but you will not live long enough to save her. I will not find her. She is mine. The symbiote will be mine. Nah, you dare. Stay dead this time. Big red loser. Gwen! You saved me! Of course we did. No one else could. They are not smart enough to know how to find Carnage. Thank you, Venom. So Eddie Brock is Venom. What's he got to do with Gwen? I'm not sure. 
I have a feeling that maybe he's been involved with Gwen after dark somehow. How did you figure that one out, Sherlock? Well, have you seen Gwen after dark in the last few weeks? No. Well, what if Venom was trying to make her like him somehow, but knew that he could only do it at night so that no one would find out? Why would Venom do that? Dude, Venom is an alien parasite. It needs a host to survive. Oh, that's not good. Hey, turn off here. Why? I smell smoke. What happened here? I'm not sure. A big fight by the looks of things. Whoa! What was that? Miles, get out. Now. Huh? Get out! Dude, what was that? Parker! That was bad. Very bad. I'll wait with you until morning. But by morning I'll have my human consciousness back. Gwen without the symbiote doesn't know any of this has happened. Yes, we know. Without the symbiote, without these memories, I'll never be able to accept you. We know. It's safer this way. Venom, no! You can't do this! We must! It's the only way to protect you. We've put you in danger for too long. to make a confession. For the last few weeks, after nightfall, you have transformed into a symbiote, and we have been together. We have fallen in love with you. What? No, no, no. This isn't possible. I can almost feel it in my head. Strange dreams. Or are they memories? They are memories. All of it is real. It's all the time we have been together makes sense now. All of it. I can feel it all connecting in my head. I think in some way I always knew it was real. But Venom, you lied to me. We know. We should have told you. The real you, how we felt. That's the thing, Venom. It's always been the real me. I just didn't make the connection until now. You lied, Venom. You used the symbiote to control my mind. Only at first. But then after a while, you started to like being a symbiote. I... did. Honestly, I feel amazing when I'm a symbiote. But it doesn't change the fact that I didn't agree to any of this. I need you to leave, Venom, and don't ever come back. Gwen, we are sorry. I know. That's why this is so difficult. Please just leave. In the pine cone? Huh. Someone in there? Hello? Someone in here? 